Dala Rieko is derived from two Luo words. Dala which means home and Rieko which means knowledge. Dala Rieko therefore means the home of knowledge. It is located at Asembo Bay in Siaya County and was founded in the year 2008 as a community-based organization by Tor and Alex. The main goal of Dala Rieko is to provide a meeting place for sharing of knowledge and good practice. Water hyacinth, scientifically known as Echonia cresceps, are vigorous growers known to double their population in two weeks. They reproduce mainly by ways of runner stem. Runner stems radiate from the base of the plant to form daughter plants and also reproduces via seeds. Each plant can produce thousands of seeds each year, and these seeds can remain viable for more than 28 years. It moves easily with water currents, winds, or other accidental means, such as fishing nets and boats. The main problems arising from the growth of water hyacinth are 1. An enormous water loss through evapotranspiration that alters the water balance of entire regions. 2. The impediment to water flow that increases sedimentation, causing flooding and soil erosion. 3. The obstruction of navigation. 4. Hampering fishing and dramatically reducing the catch and the source of food and income for local populations. 5. A drastic change in the physical and chemical properties of water and in the environment in the water bodies invaded, with detrimental effects on plants and animals. Water hyacinth can alter water clarity and decrease phytoplankton production, dissolved oxygen, nitrogen, phosphorus, heavy metals, and concentrations of other contaminants. 6. Mats of water hyacinth reduce light to submerged plants, thus depleting oxygen in the aquatic communities and damaging fish populations. 7. The reduction of the activity of electrical power stations, jeopardizing the power supply of the country. 8. A serious threat to agricultural production, following the blockage of irrigation canals and drainage systems. Dala Rieko's proximity to the lake enables its members to practice lake conservation measures which help in hyacinth control. Since water hyacinth is a floating plant, it can be removed by raking or skimming the lake's surface. Members of Dala Rieko use the harvested water hyacinth to practice mulching in their farms. They also use it to make compost which improves their agricultural output. This is a good way of making use of the harvested water hyacinth and conserving the lake. Let's have a look on how they go about it. Compost is a mixture of ingredients used to fertilize and improve the soil. It is commonly prepared by decomposing plant and food waste and recycling organic materials. In Dala Rieko, they harvest the water hyacinth from the lake and compost it to form manure and then use the manure in their farms. Let's have a look on their decomposing process. Dry stalks from banana leaves or any plant material and grass are laid, then a heap of the water hyacinth is placed on top. Then soil is used to cover it to aid the decomposition process. Wood ash is then added on top to act as a base to neutralize the acidity. Water is then sprinkled to help in moisturizing the soil. Dala Rieko partners with Jaramogi Oginga University in doing agricultural research to find out the minerals in water hyacinth which can help in improving the agricultural output of the farmers. Indeed, Dala Rieko is a home of knowledge and good practice. Tune in to the next video to learn about their smart toilet. <laughs>